I uh, yeah, started in this business in the mid 70s. Uh, I've had every kind of door from bifold doors to rapid roll doors, um, air doors, uh, everything you could possibly think of. And, and doors have been a common problem in every facility that I've had. Uh, ice is a huge problem with them. Uh, you know, the entrance uh, with forklifts sliding, um, ice getting on the ceiling, ice getting on the racks. Um, you know, this, it's been a constant problem. You, you would have a man, at least one man in every facility, spent the day sweeping and cleaning around doors. You know, I don't have that problem now with the HCR doors. Um, you can go to the HCR doors, whether it's pouring down rain outside, the humidity's 100%, uh, it's 100 degrees outside, and there's, there's no ice. You know, we, have, we have not had the first bit of ice anywhere in our facility with the HCR doors. Um, I, you know, I think they're the wave of the future. You know, they're, they're, they're just, um, I, I would never build a facility without them. Oh, yeah, and, and that's, um, you know, just, just talking, that sounds hokey, but I wouldn't. But I think they're that good. All the different problems you can have with the doors, I've had them. And you don't have any of these problems at all with the HCR doors. The, um, the maintenance on them is, um, just doesn't exist. You know, it's, it, the door's there and it's there every day. Um, it's a door, but it's not a door. The opening's always there. You know, there's, there's, no, there's no waiting for a door to open. And no matter how fast any other manufacturer says that his door will open and shut, it's still time. And along with that, that slows down your productivity. With, with these doors, uh, you have a clear view whether you're going in or out. The, um, the forklift drivers can see what's going on. I've had no accidents. You know, no, there's, I've had no near accidents. It's definitely increased my productivity because it's just a it's just a wide open shot. Doors are such a huge problem in freezers. I mean, um, they they um, honestly that's why we I did so much research on doors was and I've had a lot of people hurt doing maintenance on doors. So we were looking for something that was basically maintenance free, uh, and um, you know and we found it. I guess once a year we change the belts. Um, that's not much of a maintenance. There's no doubt about, with all the experience I've had with other doors, that, that weighed in on the decision that I, with this door. I was looking for something different, but I was very skeptical. I didn't think there's no way that this thing can work. There's just no way. And, um, and now that I've had them, like I said, I, I wouldn't buy anything else. And, and I've had every door you could possibly dream of. I could see where a guy that hasn't been around very much um, would look at this and think, gosh, you know, I just don't see the advantage of that. Um, but he would be a guy that's probably ne never had a USDA inspector come in and make him sweep his ceiling um, or sweep his racks because he's got frost and ice on his on his racks and on his ceiling, um, or the black ice that always forms around your floor uh, from your other doors with the air infiltration with the heat coming in. Um, you know, the black ice uh, that that makes your lifts slide into your racks. Um, he's never had all those problems. If he's had those problems, he'll look at these doors and um, you know, he'll be begging whoever he has to talk to to buy them, to buy them. Because they're, they're just, they do everything they're advertised to do. You know, they see our doors are just a great product. Um, everybody thinks it's the best decision in the world. It makes me look smart. You know, that, that's what the doors have done is, is make me look like I know what I'm talking about.